I decided to study engineering because I wanted to do something cool, you know, build an iron woman suit. I don't know, just do something cool. I didn't do something cool, but I did do a lot of math. Like a lot, a lot of math. So I was quite an average student, but I managed to make it out in four and a half years. Yay. Um, initially I thought, I told my parents I was gonna get a cum laude. I gave it my best shot though. <laughs> Yeah, um, engineering, mechanical engineering is quite interesting though. If you like numbers uh, and math and solving problems, then you should definitely consider it. You're going to do a lot of math. A lot. Like from the first day to the last day, it's just going to be calculate, 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 calculate. Student, like I struggled a lot, especially during the first year. Um, I think my first year was like probably the hardest year for me not because of the content really but just like adapting to the workload and the difficulty it was um, yeah it was really hard for me and I didn't know like what study methods work for me because I mean in comparison like um, engineering in university or probably any other degree varsity is like there's a big difference between varsity and high school so high school was relatively easy um so the first test i ever wrote um in uni was a physics test and i think i got like 16 percent and i was like so sad because i thought that i wasn't going to be able to do this degree and that was the first of many, 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 many fails. Um, but yeah, I still made it through in four and a half years. Um, obviously, going in, my aim was like to get it done in four years. And I think I even told my parents that I'll like get a distinction um, for the degree. Um, I gave it my best shot though, really, I tried. Um, but yeah, I'm, Honestly, I'm proud of um, getting through. <laughs> so, uh, engineering is it interesting? Uh, yeah, it's definitely interesting. If someone from high school asked me if they should do mechanical engineering, though, I'd probably tell them to do like mechatronics rather, not mechanical engineering, because I personally feel like it's uh getting outdated because the world is moving into like robotics and everything is becoming digital and i think you'd be a more skilled and proficient person if you went into like mechatronics rather than like pure mechanical engineering so if you're in high school and you are wondering if you should do mechanical engineering it's a good degree like you'll get a job you'll learn good stuff but my advice is rather do mechanical engineering and from the friends who I studied with or just people that I know um, leaving varsity or places where they work now or used to work is so I used to work in the automotive industry I didn't really do any engineering related work but my degree got me into the company. Um, I have friends who are in mining, obviously. Like if you're an engineer, especially a mechanical engineer in South Africa, you're probably gonna go into mining. And then um, I have a friend, I think he's a financial, he works for a bank, a financial analyst or you know something to do with finance but he also studied mechanical engineering and he ended up working for a bank um i have where else do i know people working i know a guy who's a clothing designer i really don't know if he like 
ever did any like engineering related work but i know that he's a, a clothing designer um yeah but anyway if engineering really helps you besides teaching you like uh the technical topics within the whole the degree essentially it really um helps you to think like think analytically and think from first principles and really know how to um derive a solution from a core problem so i think that's why like it's relatively easy like to get a job if you studied engineering um nowadays it's not really easy to get a job for anyone anywhere but um under normal circumstances where there's no pandemic i think engineers are like my what i've seen is that they don't struggle for long they do struggle but not for long uh to get a job um so having said all of that i think um i should share not in this video but in next videos my experience of being a female not only a female engineering student but a female mechanical um engineering student and how it was just being in a room full of guys and yeah how that how that experience was for me and also share how the workplace is for like a young female um in a male dominated dominated space um yeah so i think i'll share a little more on that in other videos um but this is the end of this vlog I hope you have a great day or evening depending on when I post this video and if you're writing exams I wish you all the best um, I just finished writing my last exam and I have to hand in a report tomorrow <laughs> tomorrow so all the best bye